Today I would like to showcase our gas monitor trainer set. The gas monitor trainer set consists of the gas monitor controller and a simulated gas monitor. This is in our four gas monitor configuration. We also have a five plus one available as well. Using our gas monitor controller, I'm able to send readings, deliver readings to the simulated gas monitor. I can control these in three different ways. All you do is you press the gas that you want to manipulate and then you can use this slider here for fast adjustments. You can hold down these arrow buttons here for interval based adjustments and you can use these arrows here on the touchscreen display for your fine tuning adjustments point one at a time. In a state of alarm, it is possible to acknowledge the alarm simply by pressing both of the arrow buttons on the simulated gas monitor. If I would like to train on gases that are not one of the standard four gases or are not being currently displayed on the monitor, I can change these at any time simply by entering into the menu system by pushing the center button, entering into cell config, selecting the cell I would like to manipulate, in this case we'll change cell, cell 1, which is currently set to oxygen. I will, when, I, when I change it, I select the gas from the drop down that I want. As you can see, as I'm changing the gas, it's also changing the default units of measurement. It's changing the number of significant digits for that gas, as well as the high alarm, the low alarm, and the default reading for that gas. So once I've selected the, cell, the, the gas I would like to show on the simulated gas monitor, I simply select it from the screen, and as you can see, it changes here on the simulator. I hit the back button, and then it's, it's just adjusting that as simple as just sliding the slider, and I can deliver whatever readings I would like. You also have the ability on this, on this simulator set to see the high, lowest concentrations of gas, or the highest concentrations of gas that have been read by this simulator. To do so, you enter into the menu structure, select statistics, you have the option to look at low or high, and you can do that on either the simulator or the controller. It's available as options on both. Uh, this is our demo unit on our production unit. You also have an attachment where you can attach a hose to do confined space type drills, and a number of other options are available as well. Thank you.